Alright, how you been? Are you got another one on the way? Yeah, well, no, Fuck, we already here. Three weeks old. Hey guys, this is Russ and Dot of the Kansas City Star, and you're watching Royals Daily on KansasCity.com. Hey guys, we're here in Surprise, Arizona again. It's Saturday, February 20th. The Royals had their second pitchers and catchers workout today on Saturday morning. Um, another you know, quick workout here in the morning. Ian Kennedy threw for the first time. Danny Duffy threw off a mound for the first time. Uh, at least since spring training open. To see how, you know, how Medlin does, how Chris Young does, you know, how everybody does before we finalize our roster and put together our pitching staff uh, to start the, the season. So right now, those are questions I can't answer. I go into, you know, each spring with a, an open mind. I give everybody a full, uh, you know, a full ability to compete for a job, and, and Danny will be stretched out as a starter. Um, but we'll just see how it plays out. Either way, he's going to be a benefit to us on our team. Pitchers went through pitcher fielding practice again, did some drills in the morning, and uh, most guys were done uh, by before noon. Uh, Lorenzo Cain was in camp today for the first time in uniform, uh, took some hacks in the cage along with uh, some other regulars who have been here. But position players won't uh, report until Monday officially, and then they'll have their first full squad workout on Tuesday. Um, not a lot of news today in camp. Uh, Ned Yost did talk about the second base battle between Omar Infante and Christian Colon. Not specifically, but um, mostly that it's going to be a battle, that Omar Infante will have a chance to reclaim his starting spot, but they're going to give Christian Colon a serious look as well. Uh, Ned Yost is hopeful that Infante can bounce back offensively this season, um, but they're going to kind of take it as it goes, much like all the, the position battles uh, throughout spring training. Uh, once again, um, follow along on the coverage in the pages of the Kansas City Star and at KansasCity.com. Download the True Blue app on your iPhone and Android um, and keep watching.